Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I really want to just get straight into it and answer some questions. Um, some questions that I had before I got started and then some questions that you may have um, concerning Rigoli. So I've got a few things on my uh, phone that I want to look at. So let's just get straight into it. First, what made me start Rigoli? Well, what made me start Wagovi was that I was struggling with my weight. I had been trying to get weight off for years, and it just seemed like my weight kept climbing and climbing and climbing. So I've been married for 25 years, and I pretty much just got comfortable. You know, I was trying to work out, but I, you know, my eating just wasn't there. And as I'm sure you all have heard before, you can't outwork a bad diet. So that along with just getting older, I found that weight was just harder and harder to lose. Now, I have lost weight in the past, a significant amount of weight, and I mentioned that in my first video. I've lost about I lost about 50 pounds and I kept it off for eight or nine years. But that was over 10 years ago. And the weight came off and I saw the progress and it just made me go harder. This time not so much and I don't know if any of you have had that experience yet so if you haven't then be patient because I know it's going to work do I know anyone personally that has tried it and yes a close family member but they used um, a different version which was geared towards uh, diabetics which is the Ozempic so this is a different brand and this family member had so much wonderful success it was almost like okay you try it first I'll see how it works for you so once I saw how it was working for my family member I'm like oh my gosh this is crazy and they were like I didn't even exercise I'm like you lost that much weight that is crazy after seeing that I was pretty much sold so I reached out to my primary care physician. Um, first, I was reading about it, just like you, looking at YouTube, trying to find articles. Um, then I saw that the FDA approved it back in June, so I was really excited about that. So I reached out to my primary who suggested that um, I go to a weight loss clinic that was connected to my doctor's office. So I did that. I met with my um, with the doctor and we discussed my goals. We discussed what I had been doing. Um, he went through my chart so he can see how my weight was steady um, increasing over the last three years. It was just a steady progression. Uh, we talked about that. So he didn't immediately put me on Wagovi. Like we tried, you know, I worked with a dietitian, um, increased my activity. Oh my gosh, there was just so much that I was doing. I cut back and the weight was not budging. Is it just because I'm getting older? Um, is it because, I mean, I don't know. I just couldn't figure it out, but I was getting extremely discouraged. I'm like, I need something. I didn't want like a quick fix. I just need something um, to help me kind of jumpstart my weight loss. So I started losing inches first, so I want to make sure that I mention that I have lost weight since I've started. I've taken my fourth Wagovi shot, so I've been on it three full weeks, and I've taken my fourth 0.25 shot, and within that, I've lost about mm, seven or eight pounds, roughly, the first week or two. It was very slow. It wasn't seven, eight pounds lost in a week, not for me anyway, and I'm just going to be completely transparent and completely honest. I don't know if maybe because I don't have that much weight to lose, but no, I didn't drop seven, eight pounds in that one week. This is a lifestyle change. This helps you create a lifestyle change. This helps you to uh, make better choices because it is going to decrease your appetite. And like I mentioned in my last video, if you're having issues with you know overeating because of emotions or just what have you, this is going to bring that out to the forefront and be and this is going to cause you to be more mindful about making healthier choices and then possibly when it's time when you're ready incorporating some light exercise maybe some walking or um, cleaning around the house or just what have you just kind of moving your body a little bit more so do i exercise I do exercise, not a whole lot. Um, I work out once, maybe twice a week. So that's right now. That's where my fitness level is. So, you know, I'm not going to get on here and say, yeah, I'm working out five days a week. To no, I'm not. I'm, no, I'm not. <laughs> 
um, I'm busy and not that that's an excuse, but I'm just being honest. The weight's coming off and it's a steady progression. Um, have I had any new symptoms? As I mentioned before, um, dry mouth, that was kind of one of the things. Um, the uh, headaches, that subsided quite a bit, so I don't really... You know, I haven't had that consistently. I um, will say that um, nausea will come and go. Uh, I have noticed that the longer that I'm on the medication, the more, the longer I can go without eating. So eating is just not at the top of my list. It's more like I'm literally eating to live. Let me eat something so that I can have some energy so that I'm not dragging and I'm not getting tired or I'm not getting a headache, but not because my stomach is hungry. Like that's why, that's not why I'm eating. So that is is totally different and totally new so you'll be on the watch out for that hoping to lose well not hoping I am going to lose 50 pounds on this process um, like I said I noticed that my clothes are getting looser um, what else I'm making healthier choices I'm just eating smaller portions you know my husband he's like I see you're not even really eating that much I'm like I know and I am actually getting full, like not stuffed, but I've eaten, I'm satisfied, I feel nourished, not like I've just like gorged myself or not like I'm starving myself. That's not what I'm getting. So um, that is pretty much it for this video. Um, if you have any questions in the comments, then let me know. Um, this Friday, which is going to be the 17th, I think. I think it's going to be the 17th. Is it the 17th? Yeah, I take my fifth shot and that's going to be starting the 0.5. So I'm super excited about that. I'm going to try to film myself taking the shot so you guys can see how I actually do it. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, stay tuned. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or anything that you would like for me to address in the next video. And I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching and good luck on your journey.